the realm of electronic music, there's a name that has been making waves for years. His beats are infectious, his style unique, and his journey nothing short of inspiring. Today, we're diving into the story of the one and only Trinard. Born Louis Kevin Celestin on August 25, 1992, in Porto Prince, Haiti K. Trinada's musical journey began at a young age. Raised in Montreal, Canada, he was exposed to a diverse range of musical influences that would later shape his distinctive sound. With a passion for music burning inside him, K. Trinada began experimenting with beat making software as a teenager. He honed his skills in his bedroom studio, tirelessly perfecting his craft and developing his signature sound. Catronada's breakthrough came in 2012 when he won the coveted Red Bull Music Academy's Beat Battle. This victory put him on the map and opened doors to opportunities he had only dreamed of. Since then, Catronada has gone on to collaborate with some of the biggest names in the music industry, from Anderson Tech to Alicia Keys. His genre-blurring beats have earned him critical acclaim and a dedicated fan base around the world. In 2016, K. Tranada released his debut studio album, 99.9, which received widespread praise and won the Polaris Music Prize. The album showcased his versatility as a producer, blending elements of hip-hop, BB, and electronic music into a seamless and captivating tapestry of sound. Today, K. Tranada continues to push the boundaries of electronic music, constantly evolving and innovating with each new release. From his infectious remixes to his genre-defying collaborations, he remains a true visionary in the world of music. And so, the story of K. Tranada continues to inspire aspiring musicians everywhere, proving that with talent, determination, and a whole lot of soul, anything is possible. That's the thing, that's what's happening like today in the, in the industry. Now it's more of like being present and being in a studio session. And me, it's not that I hate it, but sometimes it depends with the collaborator. You're a private guy, huh? Yeah, super. I don't know why I'm like that, but I'm... Always been that way, even as a kid. Way. And I'm just quiet, you know, sometimes it's just, I'm just mind my own business, and my own head, and some people just don't like that at all. 